Hey, how's it going guys? Um, so, I'm doing a video today on the Ford ST, the three-door hatch. Um, I have already um, put a video up of the T5 DSG adapter um, previously. Um, so the T5 engine is, uh, it's the same motor as the ST motor, the five-cylinder Duratec, exactly the same uh, um, same engine or same block um, so this customer has used my adaption kit um, for engine to DSG this is the DQ500 this car is now all-wheel drive um, and um, so what I'm offering is besides the adaption kit which couples engine to gear gearbox I'm now also going to offer a swap kit um, for this specific car as well so just to run through it um, the engine mount on the uh, on engine side uh, is completely reused the engine sits um, in exactly the same uh, position as as a factory um, as far as up down left to left to right and um, rotation it is exactly the same as factory so that mount works 100 percent um, the one on this side, the upper part works 100%, but I will be part of, part of the kit will be I'm supplying a bracket that bolts onto the gearbox, where that centering bolt then goes through into my bracket, um, but that gives you the ability to use the upper um, upper rubber mounting, uh, factory mounting. You will have to use a, a oil cooler um, adapter. Uh, this will allow you to move the, the oil cooler slash heater to a remote uh, location um, with your AN, A2 AN fittings um, so that it all clears underneath here. Now this swap, um, uh, part of the swap kit will also come with a dog bone which I'll show you shortly. A new dog bone mount that sits um, underneath. Um, the Yeah, so unfortunately on this sashi. Um, there is a notching of the sashi that's required um, and um, I do I will supply as part of the swap kit I'll supply the weld in piece for that sashi leg as well um, and then as part of the kit besides the the mounting bracket the dog bone which sits underneath besides that I'm also supplying um, the axles as well front axles um, nice and thick uh, and strong um, it will come with with inner it'll come with inner CV joints new inner CV joints and the outers um, I can uh, supply new or you can just pop your, your old ones on um, and then that's the one side and then on the other side as you can see there um, just to show you a line down here that everything does clear um, engine still sitting in exactly the same position um, 